Back in the studio. Guess who's Bizak? Let me help you. I don't want to cramp your style a little bit. Let's pop. What the hell is this? What in the hell? Who brought these guys to the party? This is football. Football. Let's go. All right. In three, two, one. Welcome back, Kick Street Podcast. Bobby Kicks here. Go T. Go T. What's going on? How you doing, man? What's going on, Bobby Kicks? You got the football jersey. What does that mean? This is this means it's football season, it's man. Good football season, man. It's football season, man. And you know what, Bobby? I, I I'm 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 in this like football right Russian realm right now. I, yeah. I just came back from San Francisco. I went to the home opener. Heck yeah. Right? I know when we air this episode, it's gonna be like yeah, yeah, yeah. So, right, right. But you know, I just went to my first 49. I've been a 49 fan since like 88, man. Heck so, yeah. Hardcore. So this is exciting for me, man. How did that go being a New Yorker and like like in a San Francisco? You know what? I always tried to be the eyeball of my family, right? Like I didn't want to do what everybody everybody else is doing, but to be honest with you, it was that gold 49 starter jacket, man. Yeah, I know the puffers, yeah, right? Yeah, man. And you can appreciate Heck that. Heck yeah. Right? Yeah, you remember I the starter jacket? I do. Remember I do. the teams. When I saw that gold, and I'm seven, eight years old, I don't know nothing about football. I just remember the gold helmet. I remember the gold starter jacket. It's a nice color, right? Nice color. And, and then the last, the last Super Bowl that the 49ers won was 94. I was 13. Nice. So now I'm getting teenage. Now I really know football. Yeah. So yeah, man, I've been a, I've been a, a faithful 49 fans are called faithful. I've been a faithful for Very a while. cool. So for me, I don't really have too much of a background in football, but I always appreciated the kicks oh, yes. and the gear and the athletes behind it just because Work. they have personal styles. Work. When you think of personal style, you think what? Bo Jackson, oh. Deion Sanders. Joe Montana, Jerry Rice. Mm-hmm. Those are the dudes that I remember growing the bus. up. Bus. Remember the bus? There you go. Remember his Nikes, mm-hmm. right? Oh, right. those are awesome. Pittsburgh Steelers. Yes, yeah, sir. Ron Bettis. Mm-hmm. So that being said, I got another pair of shoes. I been I bought these a while ago. Yeah. Okay. And this is something that's already been released for a while, but this is my first pair of these shoes. Actually, I actually had the retros before, but this is the new uh, release here. Okay. Now we had a discussion about this. I already know what these shoes yes, are. Yes, we this know. Is not a surprise on right. This is a more of a first look on hand, Word. first impressions of Word. this new shoe. The, again, Word. this is my pair. Yeah. This is the 96 DT, Air Max DT. 96. Air Max DT. Okay. The yeah. flame, flame on, the flame, flame on. Deion okay. Sanders made it popular. Yeah. Fine time. He's back yeah. coaching now for Colorado, right? Yeah. He's doing some awesome things over there. Love his energy. I'm glad he's back with Nike now. Primetime, what's up? Every time represent. We only had you for one year, Primetime. We only had the 49ers. Hey. There it is. DT, DT2s, right? We only had you for one year, but I always respect you. And we know what, Bob, what, what uh, Primetime did for us, man. Heck yeah. Our teenage years, man. Dude. Come on. His style, man, like like his track suits, his his shoes, his Must gear, be his the money. He's he's just oh, an awesome dope. player, man. So he's very influential in the fashion scene and the sports scene. So yeah. he did a lot of cool things. As you can see on the table, we have some beautiful, you know, pieces from our collection. Yeah. Um we'll yeah. talk about I mean, that's just to kind of set the stage here. But yeah. like you said, unboxing yeah. or in this case, unbagging. And I'll I'm gonna go into that. Yeah, okay? explain that. Like, <laughs> like why that I, like I feel a box right here, yeah. but a bag? A bag. So I ordered these. I don't know if I want to sit it in because I don't want to put, you know, uh, companies on blast, but I did get them at Snipes. 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 Snipes.com. Snipes. Rest for New York. Rest in peace. Jimmy Jazz. Jimmy Jazz. Because that's what Snipes turned turn into. But that Jimmy Jazz was like a little spot we, we should shop at. Nice. Now called Snipes. Snipes. So they, I guess they took it over, right? Oh, dear. Them. Yeah. I ordered these uh, maybe like a couple of days after the release, maybe even a week after the release. I, I, again, for me, I don't buy things on release. I wait. I'm yeah. not a big, like, I got to get them right yeah. there and there. I'm like, I can wait. Yeah. I, I'm patient. So I ordered them online. They had my signs. I was like, you know what? I'm going to do it. Mark. Um, Ordered them. Couple, you know, it, to me, it kind of took a little bit longer than I expected. Usually I get them within a week. I think it took a little bit over than a week. Okay, so, so time that, out. We're going to press time out. So it took longer than a week and it comes in the back? Okay. There you go. So strike <laughs> little one. Right? What? So strike one. So strike one. That's crazy. Strike two was okay. I get them. I look on my uh, my app. Okay. Oh, they got it to my house. Okay. Let's let's take a look. Let's yeah, open yeah, up the. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Actually, I don't remember if they put them in my mailbox or it was in my uh, my doorstep. But either way, I got them. I was like a bag. I was like, what's this? I was like, right. I felt. So I was like, and I look at the labels. I like, no crap. Really? They put them in a bag. Snipes. Yes. Strike two. 
Uh, okay, so I was like, and, come and, on. and I know how you feel in our unboxings. You're like a mad scientist. I say this all the time, <laughs> right? You do the finest threads. You do the you know the the tape, and so this is like the incisions, right? The incisions, right? You're like a mad scientist, a yeah. doctor, really. But for you to see that, I can't. I can only imagine how you felt, like when you saw this. I was a little disappointed and surprised, but at the same time, they're lucky that I'm not super picky on the box. Okay. I mean, I've had you know, I've had my shipments here and there, you know, get dinged up here and there, but I'm not big on that, you yeah, know, because yeah, yeah. a lot of times I'll probably you know take take them out of the box and put them in my you know clear shelf, yeah, you know, yeah, displays, yeah. whatever. Yeah, but come on. You don't ship out shoes. It's, you know, if, if you're, if you're like a sneaker store and, you know, you're dealing with sneaker heads, chances are they're not going to appreciate this. So no, no. For me, I was like, whatever. So, okay. so, so I'm not, a, I'm not afraid. Snipes, if you're hearing this, Snipes USA, former Jimmy Jazz. Um, please, um, you need traditional boxing, please. Right. Just like simple box. Right. Simple like, box. and here's the thing. We've had sneakers that had boxes in them and the boxes are jacked. Yeah. So that's true. I want to I want to preface this. Let's have some durable boxes, please. Durable boxes. Right. That's it. That's it. You know, no big deal. Come on now. Now we're getting into the actual shoes. So is there a strike three? Is are is the box damage? Let's see what damage, All if right. any, is there. Maybe not. Maybe so. So all right. So right now we're on strike two, but I have full faith. I'm, I'm all good. So again, I'm bagging. Was for- it was it US? Hold on. Mm-hmm. This is big. <laughs> was was it US? Was it USPS or was it U- US oh, UPS? Let me, let me look to the glance at this label here. It, this was USPS or post office. I know post office likes to throw their boxes like footballs, right? So they use the local post office in a bag. They didn't even pay extra money to get like FedEx, UPS. They, to me, that's strike three. Okay, right? See, I, I didn't know that like, part. Come on, as long me. as they got there. Within a you know a reasonable time frame, I don't care if it's FedEx, I don't care if it's UP, UPS or whatever. But again, th- those are my strikes. But I, I, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna say one thing because I want you to get to the sneakers. I vision that, and you have a scissor. We don't open sneaker boxes with scissors. <laughs> I know, right? We open it with, with razor blades. With razor oh, blades, cool. right? Yeah, 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 yeah. But but I'm visioning snipers on some stuff where like you know what they bought their local intern. They said, uh, hey, uh, why don't you go to USPS? We got on some your, shipments. On your there. lunch break, we got some shipments. Okay, we got some shipments. And I want you to take, I want you to go the lowest prices that you can ship on. So not even priority mail. That's what this looks like. Like this. That's not a good look. Not a good look. That's not a good look for business. Not you know what I'm saying? So you can't you know, it, it's that little out. extra, you know, service. That's so trash. let's dive into the shoes. All right. Unbagging. Our first unbagging. Unbagging. All right. Wow. Slash unboxing unbagging. of the Nike Air Max DT 96. Now 96 is a fairly new term to the to the uh to the name. Yeah. Right. So I mean back in the day it was well, like DT Max. So, yeah. I, you know what? I could probably even open this and, up and, with my and fingers. You, yeah, yeah, go. You might as well. You might as well. <laughs> I see a little hole here already. You might as well. But and, I bought um, this a while ago. Yeah, yeah. Go and, ahead. And, and for the for the viewers, DT means diamond turf. Diamond turf. Diamond right. turf is this logo right here. This is the LeBron 15 um DT, right? Collab. Diamond turf. These are the DT twos, right? So that DT means diamond turf, and that and, and diamond turf was because Deion Sanders he played football and he played baseball at the same time. Yeah. So oh, yeah, that's know, true, so, yeah. So so the plate represents the diamond, and then the goal poles represents the turf. Wow. So okay. Diamond turf. Nice. Yes, okay. Sir. I actually never really thought about that. Yeah. That's diamond awesome. turf. Yes, awesome. sir. Awesome. Yes, sir. Good stuff. So. I already opened it. You opened it with your, with well, your I fingers. I saw a little hole in there. I just took advantage of that hole. <laughs> Pause. Yeah. Um, so. Okay. OG. Okay. OG, OG box. OG, OG, first OG impressions. Okay. OG. OG style box. Nice. Looking good. Okay. A little tear there, but it's not too bad. Hey, look at the box. It survived. Ooh. Okay, Bobby. Okay. Before you open it. Before you open it. When you look at this box, right? You know, this is a DT96. What's the first sneaker to come to your mind 1996 in this box? 1996? Oh, uh, not 1996. Uh, maybe 1997. But all right. Regardless, what's the first thing that comes This from? box reminds me of the foam posits for Ooh. whatever reason. This, Whenever I see this this nice brown and nice swoosh, this always reminds me of like the foam posits. I don't know why. Yeah. So this reminds me of that, but the first Air Jordan 12. True. True. Remember, True. Air Jordan 12 was a Nike swoosh. It the 11s had. had the nice little black box with the Air Jordan on there. And then, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Which is kind of funny because right? it, it, it's like you would think it would be the opposite because right. 12s went to Jordan brand almost. Right. It should have been its like own. College, yeah, right. So Air Jordan and then also Air Max 97 silver bullets. Yeah. Right. True. Silver bullets. So 
This is a great era of Nike boxes. <laughs> Love this box. Right. That's a great detail. Okay, I'll right. give you that, Nike, because it's nostalgic. We're we're both you know uh, '90s yes. kids, so yes. that's really you know a good memory piece here. Yes. All right. All so right. so far so good. The box looks good. Size nine. These are my size. So yep. does, so does this size? Does this get a does this get a slat uh, a stripe? Because nah, okay. I'm not big on that. So yeah, right, cool. The box is good. So I think they 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 save themselves a stripe. The strike three. Okay. Because cool. Cool. again, I would have thought like it would have been dent, you right. know, dented here, blah blah blah, right. this and that. So so right. far so good. All Let's right. open them up. You haven't seen these on hand yet. Uh no. Okay. No, I, I have seen not. Them. All right. Okay. Ooh, it make you want to do the Dion dance. Look at that. <laughs> All righty then. Ooh. Here's one for you. There's one for see, me. See? Now Diamond Turf logo. There you go. Okay. That is not that's a nice logo. Logo. Real quick, so I know a lot of other, you know, like online uh, sneaker dudes and, uh, and gals have already probably, you know, uh, um, uh, what do you call that? Uh, reviewed these, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's been, yeah, yeah, and, and it's all good. I mean, yeah. for us, it's like I've been waiting for these forever, you know, just yeah. because I, I was very excited to see these retro again because the last retro was what, like 2016? 16, probably, yeah, yeah. yeah. And here's the Way thing. Back when. We, we're, we're, we're not about new releases and we got to do the, the top review. And it's about just what connects to our heart, what yeah. connects to the kicks read, the kicks and stories of us. Yes, yes, yes. yes. And this, 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 this connects to it. So, yeah, yeah for, most definitely. So, yeah. again, you know, you can see the reviews, you know, a lot of other places, but first impressions so far, so good. The shape. These are funky. I mean, I don't remember too much of the OGs. Okay. But I mean, so this so, alone looks pretty good. It looks good. It, it, it looks. Good. I'm 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 a little upset right now. About okay. It. You know why? Talk to me. Because I'm going like this. I don't feel paper. Where's your tissue? Oh yeah. You know that one doesn't. Where's your tissue? Th- this one is. This one has it. So now you. You know what? You know what I'm assuming? That tells me that these were on the uh, tribe display. These were on the displays. Come on! Don't tell me that. Because I'm has getting to. mad for you. I it has to be. It has to be. If this one doesn't Come have on. it, this one either had like their their display. Uh, what do you call that? Uh, uh shoe tree in there. You know, because they use different shoe trees when they yeah. display them on the walls. The so they probably say, you know what, size nine, get them off the wall, take out the shoe tree, and put them in there. But, but here's the thing, right? So like, you're right, but like, is this factory lace? Yeah, yours factory lace. This was all loosey goosey, right. man. Uh, this, it, no, I just tied them like this just now. Look, I mean, See, yeah, this tells this me this is not a real factory lace. This ain't, yeah, that could be the strike three, man. That could be. I, I don't. So this wasn't this wasn't a brand new untouched pair. This has some hands on it. Okay. From uh, in my impression. This has some hands on it. Now, again, I'm not super piggy because so far so good that I don't see any scuffs or anything you no. know, weird about the shoes. So at least that. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. I am going to wear them. I'm going to yeah. wear them. I'm going to enjoy them. So I'm going to, you know, really put it to work. Yeah. Uh, I can't put these on court because these aren't really a basketball shoe, but maybe, maybe not. Maybe I mean, so. These look good. Did you see the bottom? It says Dion face. Yeah. Yeah. Is that his face? It looks, face oh, yeah, man. it is. Yeah. It's his younger version that's, of him. That's cool, man. Yeah. Dion's that's cool. Face, I like man. that. Is that on the uh, OG? It wasn't on OG. Oh, okay. No. No, probably Nike. Um, yeah, and, and you you know what's interesting? Detail police, detail police. There we go. So, when they first released images of these, uh-huh. when they first hinted that it was retroing, did you realize or did you know that the back hill tab had like Dion on it? it had, it had like a like like a collar like like Dion. I, I think so. Yeah, prime, you know 20, what? You're right. New prom logo. You know what? Now looking at this pool tab, right. it looks kind of blank. Like there's something missing. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. OGs are like this. No, no. OGs oh, are like this. Okay, okay. But okay. you know, he's in Colorado. He has a new logo called Prime and R. That's right. Season two one. That's right. That logo was on this mm, to promote it. To promote it. Gotcha. So that's when we first saw glances. So now I'm thinking maybe that's a scarce pair. Maybe that with the logo is maybe like either friends or family, or maybe that was like. Just something that Nike do in like the kitchen and then they, you know, but yeah. So, yeah, I have to look at that. Yeah, I didn't really pay attention to that, but yeah. at a first glance, it looked like something was missing. But if you're this, if you're telling me this is the OG, yeah, the, yeah. I believe it. Yeah, yeah. The OG, I remember it, I, I believe it had the black Air Max bubble. For some reason, I'm hinting that it was gold. Yeah. That's one thing I do remember. I, yeah. It was gold. It wasn't really black. I remember the old Rex show did have a gold. It was more, it was yellow. Remember the old? It was like a was like, it yellow. It was like a yellow. This is the what I'm what I'm referring to. The OG had like a it was like a dark gold, but it was one retro that was like straight up yellow, like Pittsburgh still a color yellow. You know what I'm talking? <laughs> about? Okay, okay. It's like a mustard then. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, where you get that from? 
So I'm looking at the inside here. It says upper contains synthetic leather. So, okay, that tells us off the bat it's synthet- synthetic leather. Yep. Okay. Yep. Now, the little neoprene sock liner thing. This is cool. I like this little feature. Yeah. It makes it breathable, makes it easier to, uh, to, to put thin. on. It's thin. I mean, hopefully it all lasts. Yeah. yeah. I just, I like the idea of having something you can quickly put on and right. make it, you know, somewhat light. Right. I'm pulling it right now. So it looks good. It's good. Right. You know, giving that little test to wear right now. The strap. Nice little big strap here. I like the straps, man. Stay I strap. love straps. I like this, uh, the height. Bunch of straps. There you Bunch go, man. Straps. You got a stay yeah. strap. Actually, that's like a football thing. It's not, it a, football, it's not a football stick if you don't have a strap in your midfoot. Most right? definitely, yeah. Exactly yeah. right. And again, these pieces here are some of the pieces that we have because yeah. we, I, I, I'm not a football guy, like a big fan, yeah. but I do appreciate some of the pieces that did release because I actually, for example, like I had this pair as a kid. Yep. The uh, diamond, I'm sorry, the uh, air turf, the air zoom turf. Air zoom turf. So I had these. Barry Sanders. Exactly right. right. I had these in back in 96 when they released. Yeah. Actually, they, I got them on sale. They're like 60 bucks as a 60 kid. 60 bucks. Or probably less than that. Yeah. Because they were super cheap. But And and, and yeah. these, these are not really football sneakers. They are really cross-training sneakers. And John McEnroe played tennis, right? True. So, True. so people associate, depends on who you are, you may associate this with tennis. We associate these with. Mr. Bo Jackson. Right. Bo knows. Bo so knows. Bo knows. Bo Jackson, he right. knows he knows baseball, he knows football, so yep. he did he did both as well. Yep. So this kind of represents the whole football theme. Right. I like what they did with uh, the LeBrons too. You know what? That's a that was a cool idea. You I like know what? That. This was cool because this was part of the LeBron watch. This is when I felt LeBron sneakers was really 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 excited. Right. That the LeBron watch. We did. This was just like a lot of inspiration to LeBron watch. He had King Griffey ones. Yeah, that was cool. Like that, yeah. Right? He had the Nike orange box ones. Those are dope. Right. Oh, AC, yeah, that's right. That's right. Right. Yeah. ACG, my favorite. Mm-hmm. Right. So, but this is a, a representation, his, uh, love for, uh, Deion Sanders. Yes. Right. So they try to mimic these. Exactly. With these. Yeah. And they actually have a white version of this too that mimic these. Oh, well. right. Okay. Yeah. Right? yeah I see that so, red, yeah. yeah. But you can see the strap, the little gold hints right here is pretty similar. Right. It's pretty similar. So. Um, cool. That was pretty cool. I'm excited to see these release, re-release again. Yeah. yeah, this. But you know what? This time, give us the Diamond Turf logo. Yeah, right. Because we don't have the Diamond Turf logo on these. Well, which one on the tongue? It's right here in the back pole tab. The back pole tab. Um. Now, see, don't quote me on that because the Diamond Turf. It says Diamond Turf right here, but the but this logo. This logo. Mm, got gotcha, you. Gotcha. That What's logo. Yeah, and I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. That should be right here. So then like, yeah. that's not an OG feature. I, but you're right. And they did hint that he was coming back out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Th- later this year, right? right. Well, this 2025. 2025? Okay. I don't know. I wow. Don't know. I know they're coming out pretty soon. So yeah. I yeah. put these particular pairs of work. So you can see all the natural le- yellowing and so on. Yeah. I remember seeing these uh, back in 93, 94-ish. I remember as a kid. This is mm-hmm. when I actually got my Jordan 9s. I saw okay. this other kid, tall kid. He had these. And I was like, what the hell are what those? Man, I'm like... Beautiful man, I'm like, yeah. dude. The design, dude. Going back to '90s design, dude. They had it all. I could have sworn these. This was actual metal back in the day, um, or like aluminum. Maybe, I could have sworn maybe. because I remember I so. that was the thing I used to like stare at when he had them on foot. They used to shine, shine. You yeah, know, they have it looked a like a little cane. Or, 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 I'm sorry, actually, what a was, cha- uh, cage. If you look at it, this has that metal. That, that's what, that's how I remember it. Yeah. That's how I remember yeah. it. Or, or, that metal piece. Yeah, yeah, that's how I remember. It. But yeah. uh, the retros, you know, they had more plastic. But yeah. either way, awesome shoe. This one really got my attention on the football shoes. So ah, that was like your gateway drug. Exactly right. Shoot. Honestly, okay. this, just look at it, dude. Yeah. It has a strap, strap. It has the laces, nice big logos. Like this is straight nineties, man. It's tough it, shoe. You know what's interesting about that shoe? They call it. Uh, they call it the the colorway is called forty niners. But this, I don't know why. And they, I don't know if that's a new term. They, they, they did. That's a new term. But he never wore those. No, no. It's, it's yeah. Right. He, when you see those, that's the Atlanta Falcon Dion. That's the Atlanta Falcons Dion. That's like Dion dancing. These are the 49ers, which is part two. Yeah. This is a part two, right? These and it little, has that little mesh there, it has, too. It has the mesh right there. They discontinued the mesh, and these are the diamond turf, too. Nice. Right? So, um, yeah. When I when I look at this, I look at this jersey. He had these in white. He had some great colorways. The white colorway was amazing. Um, and he won a Super Bowl for us. With this, so. Nice. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Dion made some awesome memories with you know some of the you know kicks that you see yep. there. Influence over here. Yeah, this is awesome too. Barry Sanders, but still the football. And, and then lastly, this is a Harachi, but this is a Bo Jackson. Bo Jackson. This is a Bo Jackson. Trainer. This is this, the Air Rachi trainers, and this is just a classic Oakland uh, Oakland Raiders color. Exactly. Right. So Los Angeles Raiders or Oakland uh, Raiders? Back in the day, it was Oakland. Oh, was it? Okay. Yeah, yeah, so that was 
The Bo Jackson after. Yeah, the Bo Jackson. This is Oakland Raiders. This nice. is a definitely Oakland Raider thing. Um, yeah, man. Football. So, and yeah, here's but, the thing. We're missing at least 10 to 15 other football sneakers I can think of right now. For sure. To, to really, really like go in depth with football. But we just wanted to just really showcase these mm-hmm. and give our personal little collections. But guys, when you comment, when you look at this on YouTube, let us know what your dope football memories are. Exactly are. right. Yeah, you know yeah, what yeah, I'm yeah. saying? And we're in football season. So NFL is, you know, uh, going strong it's right now. Nice. And. I'm happy I got these finally. I can fi- I finally opened them because yep. it's been so long since I've had them on hand and yep. wanted to do this episode. So I can finally wear these. Yep. Do some, you know, my on feet reviews and see how they feel. Okay, what are you gonna do with these? Because usually you 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 open up sneakers to play ball. On. True. What are you do with these? these are gonna be style. These are gonna be okay. more style. Yeah, I, I definitely want to find a tracksuit that Dion probably wore Ooh. and like wear them like that. Ooh. Cause he has some really cool. You know, you can see his pictures, dude. He has yeah. some cool stuff on. So I don't think they didn't. Did they ever have a, a track suit? Or not like not matching like this. Did they have no? They have no flames? Nothing that matching. Okay, like, okay. Not that I could think of. But okay, if okay. you just look at simply the way he wore his track suits, yeah, you know, he, yeah he like that. Yeah, like if I if I can find something cool like that, like yeah. to reflect this, that's where you know that's how, how I'm gonna wear them. So okay, yeah. so yeah, I'm very excited about that. But yeah, I mean the bill's pretty cool. A lot of synthetic materials. You know, straps. Fan of the straps. Fan of the uh, the high uh, high top or mid top. I yep. should say. Um, how it, do you feel about the air bubble? It, it, mm-hmm. I mean. I know you're detail police all yeah. about that. I mean, it looks good to me. I know it doesn't have that little cool seam, yeah, like, you know. Seam, yeah, but I mean, small. the idea is there. I appreciate them, you know, looking yeah. at some of the classic models yeah. that made them popular back in the '90s, Nike, right? Right. Um, I'm happy about that. So time will tell. I'm gonna put these on on foot and see how they feel. But Snipes, please step the game a, up. Yeah, do a better job because there's gonna be another customer out there that. It's not going to be happy with like what you gave them, and they'll probably go on Twitter. They're probably going you know, to put you on blast, but right. we're not about that. Um, appreciate you know your selection right. and what you're trying to do. Great right. stuff, but you know just just word of advice. Just you know right. be a little more conscious about how you deliver right. stuff like this. So overall, before we wrap up, overall one out of ten, ten being the highest. What do you grade these? <sighs> seven. Ooh. I like that grading. We've never done that before. I like that. I like that grading. Yeah, I would say so. You start grading in the box. Yeah, heck yeah. yeah. All right, cool. So overall, seven. Seven. A, a seven because again, I had the retros and I got rid of them, but and I liked them, but they just got beat up. So okay. this is my second go around. Okay. And it's been years since I re- retroed uh, these again. Yeah. So it was nice to kind of get that anticipation going. Yeah. And Deion Sanders, he made these shoes. So to yeah. him, I, he's a ten on my list. Yeah. Him as an athlete, hundred percent. You know, but these right here are. You know, great. They're, they're nice, but they're not like wow, like OG. Obviously, you yeah, know, the OG is yeah, always yeah. going to be a ten. But I, I, I'll say a seven. Yeah. Well, it's one thing we're missing. You know what that is? You didn't do your. I now you do this with vintage kicks. The well, smell. You, you smell do your smell, man. Come on now. It's not going to smell the same. It's going to smell. I know. Does it feel like ninety six? Nah. Damn. This is damn. This is a. Uh, <laughs> oh my son, I'm taking good whiffs of that. Yeah. That's I smell, I, I do like this the new car smell. It does smell like a new car. Check right, it out. So this is a new car. You know, it's not my thing. I okay. It, it is a new car smell. Mm-hmm. I'll give you that, but it's not in the 96 smell. It's not 96. All right. But it's, it, it smells good. It, it's a tradition. It's a tradition. It's a tradition. I know we do this with OGs, but I had to make sure yeah, yeah, the body yeah. kicks smell. So seven out of 10, mm-hmm. hey, in, in certain, in certain schools, that's, that's, that's a pass test. Right? Yeah. Heck yeah. 75 yeah. maybe, right? Yeah. So just pass the test. Just pass the test. Right. I think so. Um, Air bubble, okay, we, we can go into details crazy, but overall, it brings that nostalgia back. Bingo. Right? For me, that's okay. that's where, that's where my okay. money goes towards, you cool. know, is that nostalgia, cool. like that, you know, the box, cool. cool. The the athlete, that, the, the athlete that represents it, yeah. cool. The styling, the idea is cool. Yeah. Now, if there's major things that I, I didn't notice that would have threw me off, then I would have changed that number. But right, I right, think right. overall, at a glance... I'm pretty happy with it. And the last thing I'm going to say, I'm not going to rate it because this is, this is, this, I wanted to really get insights from you, right? But I always refer AC, what's going on? Salute to you, Aaron Cooper. 50, 50 yard, yard read. read. 50 yard read. Come on. This is 50 yard read all day long. I can literally be a football field away. And if a person have these cleats on you, like, what the hell are those? So good job with the 50 yard read. 50 yard read. You know, what this reminds right. me of. Like you know the the like the like the you know like the uh, the this wave idea right is mm-hmm. like a pirate ship you know when you see like a you know like back in the day like you know pirates used to have those flags to yeah. intimidate you know this yeah. looks like like something you can put on a flag and be like all right who are these guys coming like right, you know right. 
It's right. like it has a very aggressive feel to it, in other words, right. Right? right? So yeah, I like that. That's a cool thing. Seven out of ten. All Deion right. Sanders, yep. DT, Air Max DT ninety sixes retro from two thousand and twenty four. Good job, Nike overall. Good job. Seven out of ten. All right, cool, cool. Well, you know what? This is a good unbagging. Unbagging. Can't believe you just said unbagging. That's <laughs> first crazy. time ever. That's wild. Um, but I think you know, great review, great review, Bobby. Um, I'm glad this brought that that sense of '96, you know, to you. I can't wait to see the threads. I can't. Wait. I, oh, I yeah. know you, you know, and you you, put you, 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 you got to top it off with some '96 shades, right? You got you got to throw some. You got you got throw some. You know what I mean? Of course, man. right? With, with, the, with the headband. Heck yeah, watch, Bobby. You, you'll you'll see. You'll see. I know, you'll I, see. Bobby. I know how you do. All right. It's not just the shoes. It's the no, whole. It's, it's it's the whole experience. It's the connection. It's right the on. connection. Right. So yes. Um. Salute. I love this episode. Like I like I said, guys. We didn't name half the football sneakers, right? But that's what we have. You kick storians, right? So comment below, right? Share right. your favorite. Share your favorite memory nostalgia on the gram. Let us know. Shoot, do your top five. I don't know. Let's have fun with this That's right. episode. That's right. And let's really get into the football world. And let's go Niners. All right, man. Well, that's it for me. That's Great it. episode. Go. History podcast. Go. I'm go. I'm I'm go T. I'm Bobby Kicks. I'm go T in a place to be. Let's go. Thanks for joining us. And we'll see you next time on the next Kickstory podcast. Kicks to be podcast. Hey guys, football season. Let's do this. Peace. Oh, I'm messing my go. <laughs> Thank you for watching this episode of Kickstory. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any episodes. And stay connected with us on Instagram and these podcast platforms listed here. We also want to hear from you. So make sure to comment below and give us your thoughts. Thanks again for your support and we'll see you next time.